Newsman Colin Aberdeen has been playing night spots around central New York most of his lifetime. But this gig is different. It's absolutely intuitive, natural music, you know, and really it's, uh, it's telling stories about life. And just because you're a kid doesn't mean you don't have a life, doesn't mean you don't have a story. And these kids have a new story to tell about the morning a blues man came to class. Colin has been spreading blues in the schools through the good graces of the New York State Blues Festival, teaching about the importance of a uniquely American form of music. See, one of the cool things about the blues is that you can write about what you got going on. I try to find ways to give them entry points so that they can make up their own lyrics. They don't have to play instruments, you know. They, they can learn that later, but the idea that you can make up your own song is really important. I got troubles with my parents. I got troubles with my dog, troubles with my sibling. My brother tries to sing, sounds like a frog. And if you want kids to have a broad education, a true liberal arts education, you need to include the arts and have a broad education. It, it opens doors to other cultures, other communities. In all, about 800 students around central New York will benefit from blues in the schools this spring from four suburban districts and four city schools. For this session at Chestnut Hill Elementary School in Liverpool, Colin picked up a sideman. Mike Vincitore is a highly respected guitar player with bands like Dark Hollow and the Fillmore Blues Band. But he's also a math teacher here at Chestnut Hill. That job gives him perspective on just how important arts education is to young minds. This music is math. You have to be able to count, you know, and... Uh, stay in tempo um, in terms of where the, the musical notes are, the scales and the theory behind it. Um, it's, it's, they go hand in hand, really. Colin closes the lesson with a homework assignment for the students to lobby their parents to take them to the New York State Blues Festival June 13th to the 15th at the State Fairgrounds. From Liverpool, I'm Tim Fox, News Channel 9.